This is AP News Minute. For the first time in his presidency, Joe Biden is in El Paso, Texas, for a first-hand look at border security. After he announced new immigration restrictions last week, the new rules will include humanitarian parole for migrants from Cuba, Nicaragua, Haiti, and Venezuela. Thousands of supporters of former President Jair Bolsonaro bypassed security barricades, climbed onto the roofs, broke windows, and invaded three governmental buildings in the capital. It's been a week since the inauguration of Bolsonaro rival, President Luis Inacio Lula da Silva, but many protesters are still wearing the yellow and green, symbolizing the former government. Starting this weekend, international travelers to China no longer need to quarantine. With this change, many travelers will reunite with families before the Chinese Lunar New Year. But China's ongoing COVID case surge has prompted many countries to impose testing requirements on travelers from China. From a bartending robot making boba tea to cars that change color and those with a built-in karaoke system, CES 2023 wraps up Sunday after providing a glimpse of the latest technology that could make life better for consumers. Jackie Quinn, The Associated Press, with AP News Minute.